Now, we first met my next guest on MTV's Making the Band as part of the platinum selling group, Danity Kane. Now she's a solo artist doing it her own way. Please show some love for our girl, D. Woods! <laughs> and I want to give it all to her, honey, because she's giving you all of that. <laughs> when it came to the end of the road, for yes. Danity came, mm -hmm. and it was all over the television, it was everywhere, how did you feel about them putting all of that out there? I had to suck it up and just bow out gracefully, and you kind of like... You put the pieces together. You know when you ain't gonna be there much longer. You like, mm, I got about five more <laughs> minutes. Let me grab a snack and let me get your number because we gonna work a little bit later. And <laughs> so that that's kind of how you know. And my mother, she sent a wonderful example. And people who saw it were like, you know what? You really reminded me of your mother, how she would handle stuff. And I was like, well, you know, I'm glad I had a really great teacher. And she was very proud of how I handled myself. So, you know, when one door closes, a window opens, and we're going to crack on. through it. My homegirl going to open the back door. We're going to sneak in there. Yes. Keep it moving. <laughs> so it's almost like you had to go through that mm -hmm. to get to here. Yes. So we don't regret our yesterdays. No, not at now, all. Now, working with Diddy, mm -hmm. Puffy, Sean Combs, P. Diddy Combs, whoever <laughs> you are at this moment, okay? But the one thing he is, is an incredible businessman. Yeah. How was it working under that brother? He's an incredible business mind, great marketing, mm -hmm. you, know, you know, visionary. So I took a lot of those things for myself, and of course, I'm remixing them. Come on. And I have my own label imprint now distributed through Universal Fontana. It's called Wood Grain Entertainment. Wow. And guess who the first artist is? Oh, <laughs> now, D Woods, yes. you got to tell us about your album. Yes. I say album because, you know, they don't say albums no more, RuPaul. Well, they have a photo album. Why they can't this be a music album? Yes. Thank you, Sugar. Yeah. We didn't start us something new. That's right. Tell us about your music, okay. The Gray Area. The Gray Area is, you know, a collection of songs that I, I made through this transition period, through the I got fired and wanted a new job period, you know? Mm -hmm. And instead of being depressed or down on myself or, you know, um, unproductive, I just got in the studio and did what I love to do, you know, because that's been like my therapy all throughout my life. I started performing when I was three years old. Mm -hmm. So why would I stop, you know, just for one thing? I've been through so many situations, exposed to so many things. I have a lot that I haven't even shown the world. Here's what makes me proud. As I sit here and I have these three beautiful mm -hmm. artists, Thank you. <laughs> because when you hear people talk of, I was going to give it up. No, and I that's... went back to school. Ooh. I did this and I did that. And that's why it, it makes you say no excuses. Mm -hmm. If you really want it, you can have it. The examples are right here. Just take a look at them, baby. <laughs> 